Hey, what's going on everyone? Back here with another video. Um, this one will be a little bit longer. Uh, today I got a few hanger boxes and a few blaster boxes and um, all 2022 stuff. I'm very excited to to break these open. I uh, haven't opened much lately, so I'm just gonna kind of go to town in this video. Um, I finally cleared up a bunch of storage on my phone so I can make videos a little bit longer. Um, I know it's probably not as watchable or enjoyable to be so long, but I'm just doing this for my own, my own uh, pleasure and fun. So yeah, so I got, um, I went out today to Target, Walgreens, a Walmart. Um, Target, I got a, the Donruss Blaster for 20 to five. Walgreens, I got the, I mean, the Walmart, I got a Series 1 hanger. That's all that really interested me there. And then Walgreens, I went back and looked at these mystery hanger boxes, like $5 each. I know they're going to be pretty much all junk, but it's just, it's fun sometimes to open. Um, I actually wanted to show, show you all what, I actually didn't have horrible luck compared to what I've seen before, but... Thought this is kind of funny, a CFL 2004 pack right there. And then I actually got an autograph. Um, Jared Hawker, Sage Premier Draft. Uh, I think he's at a Texas A&M alignment. Leaf autograph, probably worth absolutely nothing, but I just thought that was funny. I got a, an auto out of that. Um, and then got a cool like retro Patriot. Um, and then a bunch of sage. I know it's pretty much worthless, but it's actually the 2022 stuff. So it's cool. Um, it's $5 for all this um, Kennedy Brooks. I watched some uh, OU football last year. So that's, I kind of like the, the artistry. It's not bad. Just, you can just tell how bad the quality is of these cards and they're just so undesirable. And then I actually got a, Justin Fields leaf draft, but I honestly have never seen a video of people opening it because I just think it's so unpopular and so bottom of the bottom. And then for the baseball one, um, I actually got a Shane McClanahan first, which is definitely by far the best card I've gotten. It's still only like a dollar or two value, but that's like, that's a good card to have. Um, He's young, he's pretty good. Um, and it's not some rando from 1990. Um, yeah, born in 97, he's already a very solid pitcher on a very good team, so that's cool to have. Um, and there was a top series two actually in there, just a pack. Um, nothing too crazy out of there. I got a Luis Garcia rookie insert, nothing crazy. Um, a Padres refractor, it's pretty nice. Uh, another first I got out of, out of um, just the box. And Shane Victorino, uh, it's just for, I just like to have that. A Tim Salmon, pretty cool pinnacle card. Um, and yeah, so those are kind of the the best cards I got for $10. Um, it's just fun to open, you never know. Um, football says it's one in four for a hit, which I'm guessing most of them are just those linemen. Baseball's one in eight, and I'm sure it's the same, where it's just like a very unknown person, or else they wouldn't. I don't think they'd throw them in there if they're repacking it. Um, there's no real chase cards they point out, so. Nothing too crazy, but um, yeah, I'll get into get into opening some of this stuff. Um, I got this Bowman off the Target website, and that just got here right as I was about to make the video. I was just gonna do the the dot the blaster and the hanger, and then like it said, five forty five was the latest it would come, and still no words. So I was like, all right, maybe they're just wrong for the day, and. Um, it actually showed up like right 10 minutes ago, so I'm happy about that. So I'll just be breaking everything open. I don't really have any time um, within like the next week or so 
So I'm just gonna do it all and see what we get. Um, I think I'll start with something familiar here um, with the series one, trying to break the wander slump, um, try to find one of those. Got my sleeves, I got my top loaders. Running out of top loaders, only have a few, so I'm gonna have to keep anything good that I can't top load safe. I have a one touch I got out of one of those mystery boxes. Um, not sure why. Um, it was some unknown, like 2007 rookie or something like that. That was one touch thrown into that uh, mystery box. So pretty much just paid for the one touch there. We'll see what we get out of here. Looking for Wander, Wander Parallels, Marsh. Um, Gavin Sheets has been pretty solid. Um, Duran, just because he's on the Red Sox. Um, I'm trying um, at 0.5 view today, just because if you go to one, it's like, it's a little too close up for me. Um, just gonna try it out this time. I don't have a huge desk, so, or a lot of desk space. That there. Um, I just posted my, my Bowman Fat Pack video. Um, that was pretty fun to make. I love Bowman. I'm definitely most excited about opening the Bowman Blaster. And then get to see some of the Donruss. Gonna this back here. Um, yeah, I got a got a busy busy weekend and busy rest of the week, so I don't really have much time to open. Where I could make a few videos, but none of them are really getting a lot of attention. I think the most has been like 30 views. So this is pretty much just for my own sake. If I get anything big, it'll be cool. Cool to have it on camera. Um, there's a Randy cup card, pretty cool. Bruhan, decent rookie right there. Um, I don't think he's done much this year so far, but he's got some potential. Oh, just saw a little peek into a backwards car card. We'll see what that is. It's coming up. Urias. I feel like it's a little early for a backwards card. All right, I'm gonna try flipping it this way. Oh, I saw who it is. Or unless, is this whole thing backwards? Oh, that's very strange. What the heck? All right, well, I guess that was just an error. It's like, that's way too early for there to be a flipped card. Maybe that's a good sign, I don't know. Good sign of things to come. Nothing too crazy yet. It's a Luke Williams rookie card. Try to get, I have to go up a little closer at this point five. Hopefully you can see it okay. Rookie card, Austin Hedges. Oh, is this, is that something? It has that top symbol. Zimmerman. Oh yeah, out of 99, Sean Manea. It's like a little cardboardy. Interesting. Maybe that's vintage stock, my guess. Cool. Not the play you really want, but there's a vintage stock right there. There's a Zimmerman Refractor, Juan Soto, insert, Arenado, DeGrom, Acuna, and hey, there's a Mike Trout. That's pretty cool. I don't know if those are always upside down, but the trout is always cool to have. Key Brian. 
Jake Stallings. Up there. Let's sort a little bit here. Ernie Clement. Ricky Card. Christian Javier. I'll zoom through these. There you see a Wander on there. For the Rays. I'm just gonna zoom through. Nothing too exciting out of here. So far, got that nice vintage stock, which is cool. Kellenic just got sent down, which is kind of depressing, but um, I'm actually going to the Red Sox Mariners game this Friday, so I was looking forward to seeing Kellenic in person, even though he's not been performing all that well. But I'll see like J-Rod and um, I think Robbie Ray is pitching. Um, no wonder doesn't look like it. The Wander Slump continues. Um, so let's switch to the Donruss. I have not opened any of this. I got this hanger online for 15. Um, and then the blaster in store. I've seen a decent amount of it. I don't know if I've seen a hanger box open yet. I'm just gonna find my, my knife. Oh, that's not good. No. Um, but yeah, interested to see what I can get out of here. I know there's a lot of like parallels and stuff, but it's just uh, um, the unlicensed product. It's not the best. Still try to find a wander or a good insert of a rookie like O'Neill Cruz or. They also have those um, rated prospects, which have potential for something cool. And it's something new, something different, rather than Series 1. I've been opening a lot of, especially on this channel. And I was in, um, yeah, I went to Target and Walmart. And Target, I have this one place nailed down. This one, I have a lot of targets near me, but it's close to the city, so I'm sure there's a lot of people trying to find them, but it's like a little further, like 20, 25 minutes away, and I know they stock on either Monday or Tuesday, but Wednesday they're usually still fully stocked. Um, but yeah, they're every. I just go like every Tuesday or Wednesday during the week, and I always it's always fully stocked with the new stuff. No Bowman, which was a bummer, but... They had Don Russ, they had all the heritage, all all the kind of low end stuff that people don't really care about as much. Have a stack over here. And let's take a look at the design. Not my favorite. It'll look better. Everything looks better in the optic and the paper quality is a little better. I don't really know how they disperse the inserts and stuff throughout here. I don't know if they do it in the middle. So Willie Stargell, it's pretty cool. Matt Olson, Lou Brock. It looks like they're like two kind of variations of their um, their base. There's Stan the Man, Lance Lynn, Tyler Stevenson, and our first rookie for Cincinnati. There's a Diamond King. Another rookie, Glenn Otto. I think he pitched against the Red Sox a few nights ago. He did not do well. Acuna. Jackson Cower rated rookie. Adolas Garcia. Inserts. Yepes rated rookie. Tatis. Velade rated rookie. Yeah, there's a Carlson. Kind of like a variation right there. It's pretty cool. He's starting to pick it up a little bit. Um, he's had a very slow start, which is kind of a bummer, but I should start. Continue to buy his cards. It's hard to know. Like, you don't know if they're just all right, complete bust. You just gotta stick with them, and that's when the prices are cheapest. All right, nothing. No like parallels or anything so far. It looks like there's something shiny in the back, potentially. Judge. 
Blackman, Riley, Cal Quantrill. Oh yeah, here we go. Now we're getting into the good stuff. Ryan McMahon. I don't know if that's numbered. No, it's just a uh, stars, but that's nice. It's like a orange. Is that the hollow orange Otani? It's pretty good. Hayes, hollow orange. Evaldi, hollow orange. Montas, hollow orange. Doogie, that's a good one. Name variation and, I don't know, is that a hollow? Yeah, I think that's a hollow orange. Gavin Sheets, that's a good one too. And here comes the diamond parallels. Really hoping for a wander here. Machado. And Garcia. All right, well, it's pretty cool. It's a cool... I put Hotani right on Trout right there. It's a cool rip. Um, I definitely like the sheets. I think he he's one of the better rookies this year. But Chicago's been definitely on the injured side. And Otani. Always good to have a parallel of Otani. Let's leave him up. Nothing numbered or anything. I do like this Verdugo card. I might just have like my own personal. Um, don't know if that's worth displaying. Put the good rookies right there. And I do like these cards. Nice and shiny. Machado, potential MVP this year. Just thinking of buying up some Machado. Um, I honestly don't don't really like him that much, so um, don't know if I want him in my collection, even though it might be a good investment. All right, let's switch over to the blaster box. See if we have any better luck out of here. And this will be a pretty long video for as long as my videos go. I'm just gonna try to open all this stuff up. Have a good time. I don't wanna brush it too much. Think of buying some stands or something so I can give myself some more room but also display the cards a little bit. Maybe I'll go put this a little further back. So I guess that Gavin Sheets is probably the best. That right up against here. Brutal, you're getting kicked out. And then the Manea. All right, let's get into this blaster box. Oh, I got the Trout too. And the Trout deserves, deserves some attention too. All right, now we're actually ripping open some packs, not just hanger boxes. Always get, um, always get the serotonin going, ripping open packs. All right, this feels like very light for some reason. Donaldson, Soto, Alcantara, Wheeler, Kershaw. There's a rated rookie, Otto Lopez. Looks like there's, is there diamonds at the end of each? There's a Giancarlo insert. I really need to start just looking at through my phone so I can display it well. Turner, Mullins. All right, getting to something good here in the back. Brandon Belt, is that insert? Minor Falefa and Yuli Gurriel. Similar to the back of the hanger box. Kiner Falefa, that's purple. And another purple, Brandon Belt. This looks like the variation has the purple as well. It's 
why it looks a little different. Um, watching a video today, I learned don't look at the back, it's bad luck, back of the card. So let's see if that holds true, because I always see the back card, because I'm not very good at opening. Oh, that's cool. Pops. That Barry Bonds done. Willie Stargell. Probably should have known that. There's a Wander. Let's go. Base Wander rated rookie. Hopefully ended the drought. Joe Ryan has been very solid this year. Rated rookie. Pedro. Flexen. Chris Bryant. Devers. Purple. Apollo, put that in the cards I like. And another Devers, Diamond Kings, purple. Ooh, and an Unleashed, I love these Unleashed cards of Yordan. These sleeved up. Love me some Wander. Obviously not as valuable in the Unlicensed product, but I'll take it for sure. Go off to the side. If there's someone other than you, I don't really like. I hate the Astros, so won't be sleeving you up. You were on. Right, so I think that trick did work. Don't look at the back. Got to wander. Let's see if I can keep it going. Pete Alonzo. Luis Heel. Cal Riley. It's a catcher. And there's a Yelich Red out of 2022. Followed by a Wisdom Purple Hollow. And a Nicky Lopez Purple Hollow. Oh, and there's a Shohei Marvels card. That's awesome. Love that. That is very nice. Yeah, let's just a 2022. It's not a huge card, but it's in the... And I'm back. Sorry, I'm dog was barking a little bit. Didn't know if there's someone breaking in or something. We're all good. That Shohei Marlowe's is very nice. Oh, I saw the back. Dang. Well, let's see if the, the curse is true, if I get nothing out of here. Did good last time, too. There's a lot of rated rookies in here. I guess there's a lot of rookies, but they just don't stand out as much in series one, especially this year, with how they designed them. McCarthy. There's our, ooh, that's a nice card. Newt Bar, Stars card. Babe Ruth, Purple Hollow. It's pretty cool as well. Nando, Purple Hollow. The Rizzo Elite Series. These are all pretty good cards, honestly. I like that Lars Newt bar. Very patriotic card here. Ah. If I didn't just ding that, I might have tried to put that in. I don't think these are worth sleeving. I had a Babe Ruth card as a kid. It was 
have absolutely no clue what series it was a part of, if it was actually old or not. But it was shiny, for sure, so it probably isn't an old card. But I used to think it was, like, the most valuable card in the world, and I'd, like... I actually would wiped it down with, like, a... Uh, disinfecting wipe, because I wanted to clean it and make it all shiny. I think that ruined it, it got all <laughs> soggy. I was dumb, I was just a kid, but didn't really understand. But I thought it was like the most rare card in the world. Let's see, didn't look at the back this time, so let's see if we get anything good luck out of here. Seth Beer Rookie. Flying through it a little bit faster now. Arenado. Tell Marte, and there's a Xander. Xander's, we're hoping uh, he'll stay in Boston, but who knows what this management, they traded Mucky and not put it past them to trade Xander. And there you go, last black pack of the blaster. It's definitely more enjoyable than the hanger. It's twice as expensive, but I think it's about I guess it'd be equal to two hanger boxes and what you get out of here. Except you get to rip packs, which I love. Rated rookie there. Another newt bar. Jazz. Thinking about skipping up Jazz Chisholm graded cards. Seems just thinking about it. I feel like the all the previous classes, like you knew who the guy guys were like the year after they were a rookie. And this year it's still like up in the air. It seems like Jazz is the biggest um, upper hand right now. Like Kirilov, Kalanick, they're getting sent back down. Od Adele sent back down. Um, Carlson's not doing great. It's just like Joey Bart's decent, not great. No superstars, Jazz is like the only one I can see really breaking out, so. Um, definitely got into it the wrong year. At least my opinion right now. There's a Winker purple, rated rookie purple, and a JJ Bode rated prospect. That's a nice one. It's like a shimmer. So that blaster definitely produced better cards. That Newt Bar Stars card, the Wander Franco, the Marvel Zotani, and the Yelich Red to 2022. Um, so in the future, I think I'll be going for the blaster. Oh yeah, and they're not even 30. I thought they were 30 for some reason. The Zotani up. I'm gonna have to move these to get the Bowman. This is what I've really been waiting for. Been really excited about. The Bowman 2022 Blaster Box. I've heard a lot of good things about this. Um, keeping my expectations low. Um, a reach. Well, I guess, like, I'd be happy to get a parallel. Reach would obviously be an autograph. Um, but expectations are low, not expecting a parallel. Definitely not expecting an autograph. Um, just expecting some good firsts um, of some good up and coming players. Got trash everywhere. All these, a lot of plastic everywhere. It's back here. Let's see if I can set these up a little bit better. Wander up there. Otani's flashy enough to see. The trout. I'm just gonna put in my good card pile for my own PC. And here we go. I'm actually gonna pull up the that Bowman. Um, 
product, the rankings of the tiers. Just because I still don't, I know De La Cruz, Watson, Wood are the guys you want. Um, but obviously, you never know. As long as they're young. Oh, sorry, I usually don't talk this much. I need some water. Um, here we go. The stack is of all the, the inserts and parallels. So pretty good so far. And then I'd say these are the best cards we've gotten so far with the Otani and the Yelich as well. So let's try to get some more up here. All right, Bowman 2022, Blaster. Let's see what we get. Did not see the back card, so let's see how we start off. Luke Williams, rookie card. Louise Hill, Edward Cabrera, rookie card. Some Vets. There's an Alcan Kevin Alcantara insert. And there's a first. Michael Triana. Quintana first. Pedro Leon prospect card. And there's a Bowman Chrome first. Fidel Montero for the Yankees. 